Hi guys and welcome back to another video. In this one we're gonna talk about the space mouse and a few tips that are gonna be useful for SOLIDWORKS and KeyShot users. So let's go. So in this first tip I'm going to show you how to move the commands from keyboard to your space mouse device. Open up the 3D connection properties. Click here on the buttons and this is the list of all buttons you have on your device. Now to start programming these buttons for your application first make sure to click on your application window and, th and then bring back the uh, properties window. So first way of doing this is to click on this arrow and just type in to find your commands. Click on it and you are done. Also you can by clicking here type in the shortcuts or letter or number from your keyboard and therefore this can replace your whole keyboard, the, the numeric and the other part of it. So this can be a really good option for SOLIDWORKS users since as you can see uh, on your LCD screen the configuration changes as you move through different models in SOLIDWORKS such as part assembly or drawing. So while you are sketching in SOLIDWORKS it can often happen that while you are trying to pan and zoom at the same time your model like this gets a little bit rotated. So to stop this from happening just bring back the view you want to work in and lock it. So this is now going to disallow uh, any rotation while you are doing your sketches. So that was tip number two. So if you are using multiple applications this is what can happen to you if you are using KeyShot as well. If I for example press navigation key F for the front or right or top view nothing is going to happen as you can see I'm in the free camera so something with these uh, buttons is not right. The way to fix this is to open up the help and hotkeys overview. Here you can see it says standard views control alt from 1, one to 7. So what we are going to do is again program our buttons so it's gonna work. Open up the 3D connection properties again buttons and now here you can see, let me just click, now you can see here for some reason it has dragged my SOLIDWORKS icons and that's the reason why it's not working for me. Now to solve this we go here on camera and standard views front is first so that should be the order of setting this. So front view control alt 1 back view control alt 2 and now let's see is it going to work so now when I press front you can see now it's working so the proper way to do this is to make sure that these numbers one from, from 1 to 7 are matching the camera's order here in the key shot window and everything is gonna work just fine. So that was tip number three. Now what I also seen that people are talking when it comes to key shot is that sometimes their rotation and twists in key shot are not working. So here you can see if I move my pack from left to right and try to rotate uh, this model it's working perfectly but if you are using some older version or you don't have the latest driver 
it may have happen that your twist here is not working. To make sure it's it work, you have to go to Edit Preferences, and here in the Interface tab, make sure that Restrict to Dominant Axis is selected. Also, open up the 3D Connection Properties, and go to Advanced Settings, and here make sure that Dominant and Rotation are also on. So that was last tip for this video, I hope you enjoyed and see you in some of my next videos. Bye bye.